back here in the Unidome with AD Troy Dannon and next year looks to have some big potential with returners on multiple sports teams and, and a big potential for you and I athletics. You know, uh, as we just mentioned earlier in the telecast, you know, you always have high expectations. You know, on paper, it's hard to argue that this isn't the best or second best football team we've ever had coming in. Uh, they've got an aggressive schedule. We've got a lot of the league games you want to have at home. Next year we do have at home. So looking forward to football, uh, uh, both basketballs with everybody returning. Uh, if we're not picked first, we'll be picked second, I think, in both basketballs. Uh, a lot of optimism. Uh, you know, we have a lot of upperclassmen, uh, people that have been on our radar screens as freshmen. You know, you think of Seth Tuttle in basketball, you think of David Johnson. You know, all of a sudden those, those guys are going to be seniors. and and. Uh, They've, they've elevated the programs as they've elevated themselves uh, throughout their careers. Uh, I think the thing that gives me a lot of optimism is the continuity we have in our coaching staff. Uh, and maybe it's not just the head coaches, but, but throughout the coaching staffs. At a, at a school like ours, with the success we've had, it, it's almost unheard of to maintain that continuity. It speaks to the community, it speaks to the institution, it speaks to the environment that we have have here because I think everybody thinks they can continue to win but that continuity in our leadership they know how to get it done at our place mm -hmm. so I, I walk into the summer and I walk into next fall excited because we're not recreating any wheels uh, we know what we need to do I think everything's in position to do that the resources are there for us to do that and, and I think a lot to look forward to for Panther fans next year you're always looking to enhance the fan experience that, that's an important piece of the puzzle well, it is, and, and uh, you know, there's when you look at how we're going to generate revenue to maintain what we have going forward, because it's not coming from a new TV contract like uh, will happen at the Power Five leagues. Uh, it's it's two ways. One is is donors. You know that our, that our fans continue to support us financially through their gifts to the PSC and other other areas that they contribute. But the other is tickets, and it's you know, tickets are, have a twofold effect. One, it's revenue, but but two, it makes this a mean place to play. Yeah. And, and it gives the events credibility. And it, it, you, you think of what our student athletes have done to prepare themselves and nobody sees what they're doing in the middle of the summer. Nobody sees what they're doing right now to get ready for next fall until we see them walk out in their uniforms. But knowing how much they put themselves through to have a, a building full of fans to support that, it means the world to them. It, not to mention the financial impact and not to mention how much harder it makes it for somebody else to come in here and play. So anything we can do to encourage the fans to come in, uh, you know, the, the video boards are a part of that. Uh, we've got a fan experience committee that we've created this summer to, to try to get some people to give us more ideas of, of what do they want when they come here. What's well, going to make their experience better and more importantly, how do we incent more people and different people to come and become Panther fans. This summer is going to be a big summer. I know the student athletes are going to be in the weight room. I know the, the athletic department will be out there, golf outings, you know, fundraising, trying to get people involved in the Panther Scholarship Club. And then the construction crews will be working on things here. It's just how important is the summer to have a big fall and a big 2014-15 athletic year, Troy? Well, you know, there, summer is a season. In, in, in education time, sometimes we think of summer as the time off. Uh, summer is where a lot of our foundation is set that's going to determine the success we have going forward. So uh, I think everybody, we may take a breath because there aren't as many people around, <laughs> the students aren't going to classes, but at the same time I think everybody now doubles down and gets some things done. So when we walk in to start the fall, everything's in place, everybody has a chance to succeed, everybody has a chance to prepare themselves. You know, ultimately, what we're doing is trying to prepare our student athletes to be successful in their, uh, throughout the rest of their lives. And so this summer is when we prepare ourselves to make sure we can give them what we owe them when the fall starts. You're doing a great job, Troy. Look forward to next year. Thanks a lot. Stay Thanks. tuned for more Panther Sports Talk. Keep it here for more Panther Sports Talk.